So what I want to talk about is setting your goals. Now, everybody has a goal. We just don't really pay attention to it as much. Um, what we end up doing is we work so much for something we don't even know what we want. Um, for instance, a car. People are like, oh, I want this new Mustang, Camaro, Corvette. I want this new car. Okay, well, have you ever been in the car? Because the thing is, here's the biggest issue. You can want something all you want, but until you actually see it, touch it, physically be in it, it's a different type of motivation. What I'm trying to get to is, think about it. You know, if you, for instance, a car, if you get in the car, you fill the car, you know, you're driving, you get to test drive it, and you understand this is my car. This is the car that I actually want. So this is gonna be great, right? Because now you set a goal, a realistic goal. Now, even though let's say I want a Ferrari, Lamborghini, now those might be all out of your reach. So definitely you wanna keep your goals more realistic. For instance, uh, a house. Myself, I'm currently living in an apartment. I really, really want a house. I've been wanting a house for the last few years. Um, every time we go in, we always get the rudest salesperson. You know, people just kind of like, oh, they're not real serious. They kind of push us off. So, so what I'm going to do today is we're going to go uh, find a model home, go look at it, and we'll see what happens. So we just pulled up to some model homes right now. We're about to go check them out. Um, it was like I said before, if you want something, you gotta know what you want. You know, at the end of the day, if you want a car, go look at the car. You want a house, well find the house you want and look at it and say, you know what, I want something like this. Because at the end of the day, you're only gonna work harder because you know what you want now. And you know, I know that sometimes um, that doesn't really make sense at all. But if you really think about it, if you go like for instance myself i'm about to walk into this house i'm more like i'm going to fall in love with it now here's the biggest question after you're in the house once you go home the next question is what do you do next that's going to be the biggest thing is what are you going to do next to achieve that well, what's going on guys so i literally just stepped in right now so let me tell you what happened. So I was able to go, I drove down the highway, found a new development that will have new model homes. I currently really want a new home. I really don't want an older home uh, to be actually my home just because I don't really want to put the time and effort and restoring it, refixing it up, getting it you know, more modern, tearing down walls. I'm not really into that, I'd rather just move in. So talk to the salesperson there they weren't able to let me film inside due to legal policies legal issues that's fine i'm okay with it um, but i can tell you about my experience though so this actually salesman was really cool because you know in the past i really got bad experience with salesmen who are always trying to run my credit like hey let me see what you qualify for so i can show you the home and you know what i really don't want to go that route so when i walked in if you're in the same boat as i am I walked in, talked to the guy, hey, I've been pre-approved already. I'm looking in the area, see what you currently have. Can I show you, can I walk into these homes and look at them? Can you show me around or anything? He goes, go ahead and walk around. And if I goes, I told him, I don't want to lose any sales for you, any potential sales. Cause at this time, I'm not sure if I like it here or not. I just want to look around, browse. He goes, go ahead, these three homes are open. If you see me, have any questions, let me know. Write into him again. He kind of walked me through the whole floor pans and all the upgrades. And what the whole reason of you doing this and for me was to get more, more motivated. And honestly, the lately I haven't been really as motivated just because I know where I stand and where I need to be at to afford the house and actually get the house I really want as far as money wise, credit wise, you know, mental wise, you know, it, it's a lot. And this just took me to another level. And just because seeing something, being in it, they had a bed and I was laying in the bed and thinking of like, he goes, lay down the bed. This is a, you know, it's not the comfortable bed or anything. He goes, but think about you living in here. And that's took me, you know, blew my mind. Cause I never, cause when you go look at something, 
especially a car or a house, you really don't think of like, oh, how do I look, you know? Like, you're just looking at the car itself, the house itself, or whatever it may be. For instance, like, I thought about that. I'm like, wow, like, I could be living in here. How would I love to live in here? I'm like, then I really started thinking about like, okay, what do I need to do to get to this point now? Now, there's different factors, the key factors, whatever you need. But now, the main thing of this is I set myself a goal. I'm motivated now. I'm more motivated than ever. I'm ready to put my hustle game on. I want this. Now, even though this is not my dream home, I did love the model homes they showed me. I love the outside, the, you know, the area. The, you know, in that subdivision had like a big kiddie pool. That was amazing. Uh, it was a gated community, which I did love. So I know more or less what I'm looking for now. My mindset, my goal set, now is trying to get my hustle set. You know, this is what we're gonna talk about in this vlog is just getting you ready for life. You know, if anybody's been through challenges, it's me. I've been through from the top of the food chain all the way to the bottom, not having any job. And everything, all my struggle and all the hustle I ever did, you know, um, no one taught me. No one taught me anything I, I'm doing now. You know, everything, everything I achieved in my life, no one's ever taught me. This whole YouTube channel is be based, like I said, to help you, you know, the viewers. And I hope you like this. I'm gonna be sharing a lot more videos, different things to help you in life. Uh, if you have any questions, comment below. Other than that, please go ahead and like, share, subscribe. See you next time.